I'm Zach Foster. You're here with me on Historic Route 66 in Southern California. Welcome to Freedom Road. Come along for the ride. Let's go. I wear the black for the poor and beaten down. Living in the hopeless, hungry side of town. I wear it for the prisoner who has long paid for his crime. But he's there because he's a victim of the time. I wear the black for those who never read. Or listen to the words that Jesus said. About the whole true happiness, true love and charity. Why you think he's talking straight to you and me? Well, we're doing mighty fine, I do suppose. In our streak of lightning cars and fancy clothes And I wear it for the thousand who have died Believing that the Lord was on their side I wear it for another hundred thousand who have died Believing that we'll all were on their side They'll think the writer, I'm the man in black San Francisco, we drove up to Portland, Oregon. Oregon is a very interesting state. I saw the actual state of Jefferson, and when I say the state of Jefferson, I mean you have right-wingers, gun-toting right-wingers, who think that uh, someday they're going to be the state of Jefferson National Guard, and they're forming their little militias. And then on the left, you've got the NPR intellectuals calling it Jefferson Public Radio on the air. So I figured if the right wingers and the left wingers are both on board with the state of Jefferson thing, well, you know, it sounds like they all want it. It sounds like they're united. It sounds like we should let them have a state of Jefferson. And if they want to make it an independent republic of Jefferson, that doesn't bother me. It doesn't affect me. I live in Las Vegas. I grew up in Southern California, not Jefferson. I have no business interests in Jefferson and neither do most people on this continent. Funny when you think of it that way. Jefferson was stunningly beautiful. The tall mountains, the huge forests, and later that night we ended up staying at a medical marijuana farm and it was huge. It was industrial sized. I had never seen anything like it. Uh, so far, yeah. yeah. I would say it's just as smoggy here as in LA. Laurelhurst Park. We've got an event happening here in an hour and a half. We are not able to make any contact with the homeboy who's supposed to set up the Portland event, so I'm less than happy. Although I am pleased that all these gorgeous redwoods and other trees that they've got in Laurelhurst Park, it's pretty gorgeous. A lot of random hippies, but uh, I did just see somebody getting married, so that was really cool. Pronounced man and wife and everything. Give me some more. Oh jeez, stickers. It's embarrassing. Like domes. <laughs> oh, see those, those okay, domes? Well, have you seen the, the domes I've like, posted on Instagram? Like the geodesic domes I've made at my place. I, the geodesic that, domes? That's what those are pieces for. No, oh, they hear oh, things I'm standing on. So, I probably shouldn't be. <laughs> like we can't really. Yeah, so where are we gonna sign this? Well, there's some space over sign. there, dead ahead, below. All right, over here. It's all you'd step. All right, here too. Year 12 o'clock, <laughs> or like the whole oh, yeah, nine yeah. to three, really, yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, video. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, try again. One, two, three. Yay! Uh, still right. <laughs> it's still recording. Oh my gosh. I'm in the suburbs of Portland right now. Um, it was a very good night. 
we stayed with some really awesome, awesome supporters, and uh, we ended up talking late into the night, going back and forth between politics and geek topics like Lord of the Rings. Great times, great folks. They've got a beautiful yard out here. Um, suburbs of Portland, man, really nice area. We, as a group, definitely disagree with a lot of the politics here, but we're very optimistic that some of the folks around here are going to be willing to listen to our message of localization. Now, it's about 11.30 a.m., but uh, everybody still seems to be asleep. Very few signs of life. I'm guessing they're late risers. Lucky bastards. And um, as for me, I'm using this time to get started uh, working on the outline for this biography that I'm supposed to write. So, time to get to work. After all, that's what I'm here for. Saturday afternoon, voluntarist barbecue at Clackamat Park. This is awesome. Great times, great people. I'm building it out slowly, so I'm doing woodworking first because the woodworking will allow me to So now is this the voluntary flag? Uh-huh. Eventually Somewhere. Well, I got to Seattle after a six and a half hour drive. We spent entirely too much time in traffic. I don't think there's even that many people in Washington State. Well, whatever. We got here. We're going to a volunteer meeting at Schooner Brewing Company. Schooner Brewing Company? Uh, yeah, whatever. We'll pronounce it however the locals pronounce it so that they don't eat us alive. What breed is this man child? Uh, he is a pit bull cross with a mastiff. Oh, and he is showing us his stuff. Yeah. His most prized <laughs> possession. <laughs> Stay still, damn you. You're really cute, and I'm trying to get you on camera. Hello, dear. Yeah. <laughs> he is big, happy. Yeah. Big, happy, goober. I love his Still at yeah. it. He's so handsome. Still at it. <laughs> buddy. <laughs> yeah. Showing off for the camera, buddy. You guys are gonna stop. Oh, what else is he gonna bring out? Look at my butt. I can dance. Why my beard? Wow. 
Mr. Doge. Uh -huh. It's hard to get mad at him. Uh -huh. We do this. Uh -huh. <laughs> no, no, we smell. He's like, hey, you guys smell cool like Ashley's. There's like 20,000 places. We have been 20,000 places, haven't we? Yeah, oh, he smells like rock leg. Whoa. Oh, and now we've got the next item in show and tell. This is the farthest north on the west coast I have ever been. Me too. Me too, man. We're right up near the Canadian border. <laughs> Too bad we don't have our passports. I know. We I said, sorry, here. sorry, Adam. You got to stay in San Fran yeah. extra day <laughs> because reasons. Uh huh. Because French fries and gravy and maple syrup. Mm -hmm. Mono Island, Washington. We're outside of the crow's nest and it's absolutely breathtakingly beautiful with these trees. Although we are trying to figure out, well, we're gonna have to figure out the dilemma of how to back this trailer out of this very narrow parking lot with these magnificent classic cars that are worth tons and tons of money if any of them got bumped but we're not gonna have that problem because we're awesome. And yeah, freedom and stuff. No matter what state you're in, the 405 North is cursed. Look at that. Yeah, no thank you. Glad we're going south. Although, not much more successfully. Ah, yeah. Don't tell me that my smugness was premature. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, really? Yeah. Four years ago when he started doing his thing. He was like, well, hey, the Nash Principle is weak. It's weak. You have to go fight these people. Something like that. ships. Oh, the fierce ships. Oh, the beautiful sharp-out steamships and sailing ships. City of the world. For all races here, all the lands of the earth make contributions here. City of the sea. City of hurried and glittering tides. City whose gleeful tides continually rush or recede, whirling in and out with eddies and foam. City of wharves and stores. City of tall facades of marble and iron. Proud and passionate city. Meddlesome, mad, extravagant city. Spring up, O oh city, not for peace alone, but be indeed yourself. Fear not. Submit to no models but your own, O oh city. Walt Whitman. I'm going up the harbor steps, which is actually a gigantic multi-block staircase. Kind of regretting going up here now, but oh well, too late to do anything about it. Anyhow, I'm on my way back to the trailer because Ben forgot his backpack. It's got some vital stuff in there, so I'm the lowest on the totem pole. The other two have to stay and do politics with the guests and try to build up a state organization for Washington for the not campaign. So, got to get back to running to the trailer. <sighs> First, still another block. Gigantic builder dude.
walk around with that beautiful girl, okay? Can you talk a little bit Damn. about the right and the politics or the political style of the left? We don't have the camaraderie, we don't have the trust level that our rivals do. And that camaraderie and trust is built up. Hey. Say goodbye. Oh. Thank you. Tempted to let you guys kidnap me, but. <laughs> yeah, why not? Come Very on us. What do you mean, let? Very tempted. I have a daughter waiting. <laughs> Next time on Freedom Road. A lot of people think that the entire state of Washington is basically Twilight Land with the dark and dreary forests, but this obviously is a corner of Washington that's really taken us by surprise. And Look, it's overflowing. This is what's burning.